In this video, we're going to be learning about the broadcast feature and how to use it to send messages to multiple people. Now, in order to get there, you go to the company drop down under other and then click on broadcast message. Now, when you get there, your screen is going to look somewhat like this. On the left side, you're going to have the means of sending the message, and on the right side, you're going to have the employees you're going to be sending it to. Now, the first thing you want to figure out when you're sending a message is who you're actually sending it to. The default is for the message to be sent to every employee throughout every branch, but you have ways to sending it to only a specific branch or to specific people. Now, to send it to one branch, you just make sure the branch that you want it to be sent to is the only one selected, and then uh, the list of employees on the right side will shift to accommodate your selections. As you can see, the only employees that are shown are the ones from the specific branch I want it to be sent to. Now, to send it to specific people, it doesn't matter if they're in like different branches or like different types of employees. Uh, you just go up to this box right here, select that, and it'll unselect every employee. And then you can go through and select the people you want it to be sent to, like that. Um, in this case, we're just going to be sending it to one. I just wanted to demonstrate. So next you want to figure out what type of message that you're sending. You have two ways of doing it. You have email or text message. And when you sele select each one, on the right side here, it'll show like what email or what phone number they'll be contacted by. In this case, we're going to be writing an email. Um, let's say example email. And my message, this it's just a test. So you write your message and then you send it. And this right here is a confirmation page to show you that your message is sent and then it'll list all the people that it has been sent to and the uh, email or number that it was sent to. So to see if it actually worked we're going to hop over to my email and as you can see, I've sent multiple messages to myself already, but you can see I got this is just a test. And that is how to use the broadcast message.